Hi, welcome to Informatica video cabbie session. My name is Nagaraja Rao, working for Informatica Global Customer Support. This presentation talks about how the objects are deployed from source to target repository which are placed in the different domains. The agenda of the discussion is how the communication is established between source and target repositories and what are all the issues that we come across while deploying the objects from source to target repositories which are placed in the two different uh, domains and also where the domain details of uh, node and the service will be stored and uh, is the service restart is required when we add the domain details. When repository manager is uh, connected to the source repository to transfer the objects to target repository. There is also a connection that gets established between source and target repository directly. Through this connection, the objects will be deployed not through the repository manager client application. Repository manager client application is only responsible to establish initial connection, but once the initial connection has been established to source and then the target repository, then both the repositories will talk each other. So, to make sure that uh, the communication happens between them, each of the service should have the details of the domain of other service where the service is running, like uh, the node and as well as the domain details and also the port number. When we deploy the objects uh, from source to target repositories, as I said, uh, the, each of the service uh, should have the knowledge of the other service domain details. If uh, they don't have the knowledge, then the issues uh, uh, will arise like a communication issues. When I try to deploy my uh, deployment group from development to the test repository, if the test repository doesn't have the details of development repository, then I get this uh, error saying that an error occurred during deployment failed to connect to the development repository. So I need to add the details of uh, the development domain and details into the source uh, uh, into the into my target uh, uh, doma domain but how can i add them basically where the domain details are stored the do do domain details are stored in the domains.info file in the info home directory but uh, directly editing the domains.info file is not uh, suggestible so better to use the pmrep command to connect to the source repository from the target domain where the target repository is running. When uh, I can, this is the this is my target machine where the service is uh, running. I can use a pmrep command to connect to the source repository service, which is a uh, rep pc dev once this connection established then i can once the connection establishes then uh, the details will be uh, stored in the uh, domains.info file of the target repository service see the domain domain clean cle 961 hf1 is the source uh, repository domain and also the uh, the port number and the name of the host where the source repository service is running but is it enough to transfer the goods from source to target repository let me let me try now when i tr try to deploy the objects uh, still i am getting the error this is because when I add the domains.info file, uh, uh, the entries are added to the domains.info file, my service has to be restarted to pick the latest uh, uh, information from the domains.info file. Until unless uh, the service is restarted, the domains.info file uh, uh, details won't be picked up. So, but uh, is it required? Mm, is, it requ is it required to like? Uh, uh, restart the service uh, before each deployment? No. Only when the service startup, 
the service will uh, read the uh, data from the domain start info file and loads the details into its uh, cache. Once I restart my service, then by the time of uh, restarting the service, it goes and uh, reads the uh, uh, like contents of the domains.info file, latest contents of the domains.info file, so that I it will allow me to transfer the uh, goods from uh, source to target repository. Uh, let me try now reconnecting to my both source and target repositories, and then uh, like uh, I can try whether I can able to transfer the goods to my source uh, uh, source to target repository. These uh, 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 domains.info file changes uh, is a must, otherwise the uh, each repository cannot able to establish uh, the connection with uh, each other and the deployment cannot be possible. Now after loading the domains.info file latest content into the service cache, I am able to successfully transfer my codes. If you have any questions regarding this session, please uh, uh, mail to us support videos at uh, informatica.com. Thank you.